Hi friends, I'm Megan and this is Our Handcrafted Life and today we're going to be making vintage science flashcards. So right now I'm in the process of making an outdoor research station, science center, whatever you want to call it for our kids and I wanted some flashcards to go along with it so they could try to have some fun identifying different things in nature while they're outside playing. The first thing you're going to need is this laminator. Um, this is a swing line laminator. I got it on Amazon. I think it was about 30 bucks and I use it all the time. I'm using it for this project. I've used it for things like tabletop cards and preschool papers for our daughter to you know use dry erase markers on. Um, I used it for her pretend play menu and pretend money to play with in her little kitchen. Um, just all kinds of things. So this has been really useful. And you'll also need the laminating pouches to go with it and these are just the Amazon Basics ones. You can use any laminating pouches that you want though. And I'll link to all this stuff below. So if you have any questions about the specific products that I have to make this project, um, you can find it in the little drop down section below. You also need a hole punch and some binder ring clips. And these are really nice. It's just a single clip, but it opens and closes. Um, and so that'll hold all of our flashcards together and you can hang them on a little hook. And then finally, you're gonna need the printables from ourhandcraftedlife.com. So if you go there and you search for science flashcards, you'll be able to find these printables. Um, and I'll link to them directly below as well. But um, we have three different packs. We have trees, and these have all different kinds of leaves. And then we have the vintage bird flashcards, which are really cute and flowers. So we're going to be making all three packs today. These are made using illustrations out of antique books, out of antique reference books. So they're free from copyright, but I just thought they looked so much prettier than, you know, kind of some of the flashcards that you find today. Um, just really unique. These flashcards are so simple to make. The first thing you're going to want to do is print out your flashcards. Then Power up your laminator, let that start getting heated, and then you're just gonna cut out the flashcards. Um, I love using really, really sharp scissors um, to cut anything out. I have one pair of scissors only for paper products and one pair of scissors only for fabric. They're marked, they're put away. Kids are not allowed to use them for whatever other projects they want to use. These are my, my scissors. Um, it makes such a big difference in your end product because you know, if you're hacking off the sides of the things that you're cutting out to laminate, it's just not going to look as nice as if they've got a really nice, sharp, clean edge. So go ahead and cut out your flashcards. After your flashcards are all cut, you're going to put them in the laminating pouch to go through the laminator. You just want to make sure they're evenly spaced with enough room to give them a nice edge. When it's all done, you're ready to cut. You just cut off the excess laminating paper. I like to cut them with a little bit of excess on the outside and then trim it down so I can be pretty precise. Once you've got all your cards cut out of the laminating paper, you're going to hole punch them right in the corner. And then, it'll go on your binder ring clip. Now 
Now I'm going to finish the rest of these and then I'll show you the final product. So here's our completed set of vintage science and nature flashcards. I love how they turned out. They're really cute, but they're useful also. You know, we don't know what we're doing with schooling yet for our daughter. She's still in preschool, so we're not sure if we're gonna like homeschool or public school or charter school, whatever. But these would be really cute for um, homeschool or unschool or, you know, they'd work with like the Charlotte Mason curriculum. Um, or really any science and nature study. But they're also just cute for your kids to play, you know, pretend. They can pretend to be a biologist outside um, and study science and nature. So this is the tree set. And then we have the birds. I love the birds. They're so cute. And then the flowers. more of those, all the different flashcards that are included on the blog. Um, if you have any questions, let me know in the comments below. And if you want to see more videos about living simply and creating beautiful things, if you're new around here, hit that subscribe button so that you'll be notified every time a video gets posted. Okay, I'll see you guys next time. Bye!